Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. So today we are discussing on five signs that might tell you your gut is in bad shape and also steps we can do to bring it again in the good shape. So before we dive in, let's first get to know what is gut and why gut health is so important. According to experts, your gut is like the second brain to your body as it plays a crucial role in your well-being from digestion to immune function. And so if it is unhealthy, it can take a toll on your entire body. And also poor gut health may manifest into various problems that go way beyond the digestive issues. And so it is important to fix them before it becomes too late. So why gut health is so important? Your gastrointestinal tract starts with your mouth and ends with the anus. While the body takes in food, digests it, absorbs nutrients and expels the waste from the body. If the system is not working properly, it will affect total functioning. So experts also say that bad gut health can cause mental health disorders, autoimmune disease, gastrointestinal disease and also cardiovascular disease and even cancer. So that's why gut health is so important. So we are going to dive into the five signs that can actually tell you that your gut health is uh, in bad situation. So first sign is stomach discomfort. If you have been suffering from frequently upset stomach with symptoms like severe gas, bloating, diarrhea, constipation and recurrent tummy edges. All of these signs are an irritable bowel syndrome, a common digestive condition that affects the large intestines. So according to studies, unregulated gut bacteria known as dysbiosis play an important role in development of IBS for some people. Second sign is weight fluctuations. Studies say that there are major differences in the gut microbiomes of lean and obese people. Those who eat a western style diet which is high in fat and refined carbohydrates promote intestinal bacteria which is linked to obesity. Experts also say that western diet leads to gut barrier dysfunction causing low grade systemic inflammation, a key factor in the development of digestive disorders. And third sign is skin issues. There is a close connection between an unhealthy gut and skin issues like asin, psoriasis and echisma that lead to intense itching or even the bleeding situation. So leaky proteins from your gut are recognized as foreign particles by your body which attacks them by triggering an autoimmune inflammatory response in the form of irritation and the breakouts. Fourth sign is mood swings. A bad unhealthy gut can extend to your mood as well. Studies say that gut disturbance and inflammation in the central nervous system are potential cause of stress, depression, and anxiety, and that probiotics may help treat these conditions. Harvard Health say there is an autonomical and psychologic two-way communication between the gut and the brain via the vagus nerve. And the fifth sign is fatigue. Doctors say those who suffer from chronic fatigue and tiredness usually have imbalances in the gut microbiome, which consist of the bacteria, microorganisms, fungi, and viruses present in the gastrointestinal tract. So we have also found that almost half of the people with fatigue also had IBS. So we have seen signs. Now how do we fix a bad gut? So there are some lifestyle and diet changes we need to consider. So first step is we need to lower our stress levels. Chronic stress can be very hard on your entire body, including the gut. It happens because your body releases certain hormones when it experiences stress, which compromises gut health. A few way to lower stress includes the meditation, yoga, walking, some uh, moderate exercise, getting a massage, spending time with friends and family. So also uh, taking a good nap and sleep. Uh, is also a best way to beat the stress. So see which seriously impacts your gut health, which can turn contribute to more health issues. So you should prioritize uninterrupted and sound sleep every night. Second step is you should always eat slowly. Doctors advise chewing your food thoroughly and eating meals slowly while enjoying taste and flavors to lower your chances of developing obesity and diabetes while also reducing digestive discomfort and maintaining a healthy gut. Take pre and probiotics. Regular intake of pre and probiotic supplements in your diet can help improve your gut health immensely. 
both of these promote the growth of beneficial bacteria in the gut and the digestion related issues and weaken immune system your gut health impacts more than you might realize and recognizing the signs early can help only take control of your well-being by following simple effective steps to reset your gut you can get back on track to feeling healthier and more energized so if you found this video helpful don't forget to like and share with those who need this information badly and also subscribe uh, for such amazing health and wellness tips i will see you in the next video thank you